Hi, I'm Shelly Wood and this is my tiny sewing room where I make doll clothes sewing videos. Today I'm going to show you how to make a pointed witch's hat which will fit most 11 inch fashion dolls like Barbie, Francie, Made to Move Barbie and similar size dolls. But before we begin, please go to Shellywood.com to download the free printable PDF sewing patterns for these two doll hats. Look for a link below this video on YouTube. Use your patterns to cut out all the pieces shown. Now pay attention, these two pieces were cut from craft foam, they're not fabric. My craft foam is quite thin, which allows for better fl flexibility. Lay one of the cone fabrics on top of another, keeping, as we say, right sides together, or the pretty sides touch the pretty sides. Sew around the right angle section, clip the corner of the fabric cone, turn the fabric cone right side out. I often use a chopstick to help with inverting something like this. Press your seams and then insert the craft foam like you see me doing here. Now lay one of the brim fabrics on top of another, once again keeping your right sides together. This is fabric of course. So around the outside of the circle, leaving about a one and a half inch or two centimeter open end at one end and then clip around your seam. Invert the brim, pinch the open end together, tucking the raw fabric inside. Whip stitch to close this tucked in area. Now if you need help a whip with the whip stitch, I have a tutorial for that. Just look in the description area below this video on YouTube. Pinch the foam brim together and tuck it in between the fabric brims. Now let's attach the cone. Lay the cone alongside the brim like you see here and then stitch all the way around, attaching only the black fabric to the black fabric. The cone will be bigger than the brim and that's okay, that's actually what you want. Here's a side view of what we have so far. Pinch the black fabric together so the cone matches the brim's opening's circumference. Whip stitch to close the cone along this area and try to keep the yellow fabric hidden inside the cone. Stitch all the way to the top of the cone. Flip it over so we can seal up the opening. Pull the yellow fabric through and turn the raw edge of the inner fabric under. Then whip stitch it to the brim all the way around. I started and ended right where the fabrics joined. Now you're ready to try the hat on your doll. For more free printable PDF sewing patterns, to fit dolls of many shapes and all different sizes, please remember to visit my website ShellyWood.com. I'm Shelly Wood and this is my tiny sewing room where I make doll clothes sewing videos. You guys have inspired a lot of the doll clothes that I have designed, the free patterns that are, that are available at ShellyWood.com. But my list of requests is becoming huge. So it's time for me to offer a course where I teach you the three easy methods that I use to design doll clothes patterns. 
If you're curious about my class, I recommend that you go to creativespark.ctpub.com where you can sign up for their newsletter. That's the platform I'll be using for my paid courses. If you enjoy my free tutorials, wait till you see what I'm creating for Creative Spark. I look forward to creating amazing patterns with you.